today on my show of what topic I'm going to talk about today is um Disney World and what I'm going to talk about today is um I'm going to talk about the history of Godzilla Bullet Train Ride once planted but it was never built because it was scrapped for example um a long time ago um disney world like once planted a godzilla bullet train ride somewhere in the um epcot japan pavilion but it was never built because The concept would have been, like, a special attraction for Epcot's Japan Pavilion. And based on the country's famous bullet trains, the ride is attacked by Godzilla. As passengers probably probably scream and out of S. S-Y-N-C dialogue and uh, and onlookers wonder where on earth earth they found a man big enough to fit in that rubber suit because I think this ride Godzilla ride would have been like so awesome and cool at Epcot's Japan Pavilion. I think the ride, like... So, if... A long time ago... Like, if Disney World, like... Um... Built the Godzilla Bullet Train ride a long time ago. Like, I'm gonna guess somewhere in the 90s. Like, that would have been an awesome... Like, ride for the Godzilla fans. But... It wasn't built a long time ago because the ride was scrapped. And and I wanted to make this episode today for the Godzilla fans because I think Godzilla is a cool, awesome monster creature. And there's also a, a remake of um Godzilla the 2014 version and I think like for it's off topic because you know how there's the older like Godzilla films well I heard that um there was the 2014 version of Godzilla yeah and That's all for my show today. And, um, make sure to comment below of, um, if the Godzilla bullet train ride was at, um, Disney World at the Japan Pavilion Epcot Center. Would you ride it if it was there and why? Um, don't forget to subscribe And click like on the bottom below if you enjoyed this episode today. And that's all for my show today. And see you next time.